New Parkinson's breakthrough. That's right. For the first time ever, scientists may have discovered a way to slow down or even halt the progression of Parkinson's disease. Not just manage the symptoms, but go after the actual cause of the disease in the brain. It's a brand new treatment called presinezumab, and it could change everything we thought we knew about Parkinson's. If you or someone you love is living with Parkinson's disease, you'll want to see this. I'll walk you through exactly what this could mean for your future. Parkinson's disease, a neurological illness that affects over 10 million people worldwide. And unfortunately, once Parkinson starts, there's no cure. No way to stop it. Only treatments that manage symptoms temporarily until now. Because something is changing. Meet Presinezumab, an experimental drug that does something no current Parkinson's medication can do. It doesn't just hide the symptoms. It tries to slow the disease itself. How? By targeting a protein called alpha-synuclein, one of the biggest troublemakers behind the scenes of Parkinson's. You see, scientists have discovered that clumps of this alpha-synuclein protein build up in the brains of people with Parkinson's. These clumps interfere with brain cells and may even cause them to die off. Presinazumab is designed to hunt down and bind to these harmful proteins, clearing them out before they can do more damage. Think of it like sending in a cleanup crew to remove the mess that's making things worse. And the results from the latest trials? They're surprising, in a very good way. In a major study called PADOVA, over 580 people with early-stage Parkinson's took part in an 18-month trial. Half received the usual Parkinson's medications like levodopa. The other half? They got those same medications, plus presinezumab. Here's what happened. Those who received presinezumab showed signs of slower motor decline, meaning they were better able to move, walk, and perform daily tasks compared to those who didn't receive the drug. And the effects? They weren't short-lived. They lasted across the full two years of observation and possibly beyond. Even more encouraging, participants who stayed on the drug longer in what's called an open-label extension study continued to show improvement over time. And for seniors already taking levodopa, which is many, presinazumab seemed to offer even more protection. It didn't just work. It worked better on top of existing treatments. Now, we all know that with any new medication, especially in older adults, safety comes first. And that's where presinazumab passes another important test. In the studies, over 900 people received the drug. Some have been on it for up to five years now. And the side effects? Very few. Presinazumab was well tolerated. No serious safety concerns were observed. That means seniors, like you or your loved ones, could potentially receive this therapy without putting their health at risk. That's not just encouraging, it's rare. Imagine this for a moment. You're newly diagnosed with Parkinson's. You're still walking independently, still living life, enjoying time with family, hobbies, and everything you love. But now, instead of watching your symptoms slowly get worse, your doctor gives you a treatment that may slow it all down, maybe even stop it from progressing. You still take your regular medications, but presinazumab adds another layer of protection, a shield against further decline. That's what this drug could represent. And while it's not yet approved, it just moved into phase th three trials, the final stage before worldwide approval. That means real progress is happening, and fast. Most Parkinson's drugs, like dopamine agonists or levodopa, treat the symptoms. They help you move better for a while, but the disease keeps progressing in the background. Presinazumab is different because it targets the root cause, the buildup of alpha-synuclein proteins. That means it's part of a new category called a disease-modifying therapy. These are the holy grail of treatment, the kind we've waited decades for. If presinazumab proves successful in phase the three, it could become the first ever approved drug that slows Parkinson's itself, not just the symptoms, and that's revolutionary. So, what does this mean for you today?
First, prasinezumab is not yet available in pharmacies. It's still being tested. But the fact that Roche, one of the biggest names in medicine, and is pushing it into the final trial stage, means they're confident in what they're seeing. Second, if you or someone you love has early-stage Parkinson's, and especially if you're taking levodopa, this is something worth discussing with your doctor. Clinical trial locations may be expanding soon. Third, stay hopeful. Because this is one of several new therapies on the horizon, and it shows that the scientific community is serious about slowing Parkinson's in our lifetime. If you found this helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel, Senior Health Formula. We break down the latest medical research for real people in plain, clear language that seniors and families can actually understand. And if someone you love is facing Parkinson's, share this video with them.